Sooner or later, every freshwater aquarist will come across maybe the most common aquarium disease, white spot disease called ick. In today's video I'll show you what to do right after you'll first time observe ick in your aquarium. But first of all, relax. Ick is something like flu that every one of us at some point went through. If your fish are healthy and you discover ick soon, it will only take few days to cure. Ick is protozoan disease and is usually present in the environment of most of freshwater aquariums. Because it's so widely spread, many aquarium fish have already developed immune response to fight off this disease before it ever shows any symptoms. However, when the symptoms show up, they are very easy to observe. You will observe white spots on your fish, usually mostly on gills and body. As disease progresses, it will become more annoying and disturbing for the fish, so they may try to rub or scratch it off on various surfaces. Now to be able to kill ick, we first of all need to understand its life cycle. Life cycle of ick is temperature dependent, meaning that the warmer the water, the quicker the life cycle process will be. In cooler water it may take several weeks, however in warmer water it may take only 4 to 5 days. At the beginning you'll observe the white spots on your fish, what is basically ick feeding of the skin of your fish. After a couple of days it will fall off to your substrate. There it will produce babies, called tomits, and soon will burst and release these tomits to the water. Tomits will again penetrate the skin of your fish and the cycle is repeated. When the tomits are released, that is the time when we can kill ick. There are many medicines available that will kill tomits and cure the ache. However, many times you just don't have them on hand or like in my country you need to get prescription from the web to get them or order them online. Medicines may also have unwanted side effects and in case that you only have some hardy fish, I would definitely recommend doing this simple trick. Add the heater into your tank and heat it up to over 30 degrees Celsius, what is around 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Increase temperature throughout the day slowly, so the fish can acclimate to it. As warmer water has less oxygen, add air so to increase the oxygen level. I would also recommend adding aquarium salt, as from my experiences it's very helpful. I'm adding 1 tablespoon of salt per 10 liters of water, what is a bit more than 2.5 gallons. At this temperature it cannot reproduce, what means that once it falls out of the fish, it cannot produce tomits and will die. Vacuum the gravel every day to remove the fallen ick out of your tank. After all white spots from your fish will disappear, keep heating up the tank and vacuuming the gravel for at least 5 days to secure that the treatment is really complete. As you can see, my fish are healthy again and I didn't lose a single one. I hope you've enjoyed the video and found the information you were looking for. If yeah, please make sure to subscribe my channel and I'll see you next time.